crazy. So cool. Death's shadow. Hey, what's up you guys? It's Tawny Teacher's T and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. Last episode, we were in Hogsmeade with Natty, getting a little info about the bad deeds Harlow has been up to, trying to get some proof that we showed to Officer Singer. And hopefully she will take that and lock him up, throw him in Azkaban. But we also saw the centaurs with Poppy. That was a little cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs. If you haven't seen that, definitely check it out. But I am so ready to get into this next episode with you guys. Let's check it out. Ah, I have been meaning to speak with you. I still can't believe we escaped the Ashwinders. You may not realize it, but you are the talk of the school since you saved me that day. I wonder how everyone knows about it. I told my mother in the hope that she would be more forgiving of what I have been up to if it came from me. She likely told other professors and <laughs> news travels quickly. Unfortunately, she might, in fact, have been even less forgiving than I'd hoped. Hmm. If she knew more about what you've done, I suspect she'd be proud. If she knew any more about what I've done, she would never let me out of her sight again. I'm sorry. Has Officer Singer done anything with the evidence we provided? She has right. not. <sighs> Halo is as strong what? as ever. Someone needs to stop him, whether it is us or Officer Singer. If someone had stopped the monsters like him in Matabililand, my father would be alive today. What exactly happened to your father? It was a beautiful day. My mother had gone to tend to a neighbor who was ill, and so my father and I were galloping in the savannah. Galloping? Your father was also an Animagus, I take it? He could become the most majestic giraffe. Whoa. And he would carry me on his back, my arms around his neck. We were on our way home when we surprised a group of bandits who had come from our village. One of them saw me just as he removed a scarf from his face. He shouted and then aimed his rifle. Oh, he no. didn't want you to identify him. Exactly. In an instant, my father bowed his neck to protect me oh, no. and was hit. As he fell, my father changed back into his human form. When the bandits saw this, they turned and ran in fear. Magic terrified them, and then he was gone. <sighs> and it was all my fault. Your no. fault? How so? He died protecting me. If I had been capable of protecting myself, he would still be alive today. My mother and I tried to go on without him, but it became too much for us there. A few years later, we left to come to Scotland. Wow. Do you think your father would approve of the things we've been doing? Oh my, that is a good question. In theory, yes. Although he would worry as my mother does. But I think he of all people would understand my persistence. My father never shied away from a fight for good, no matter how ruthless the foe. And I think he would have enjoyed knowing that I had a compatriot like you. <laughs> what does your mother think about all of this? Well, as you saw, she worries a great deal. She is an excellent seer, but I think it bothers her to this day that she did not see my father's death coming. She misses him, as do I. So I believe on some level she understands my need to seek justice in a small way, but that does not mean that she likes it. Do you think taking down the Ashwinders will avenge your father's death? No. Vengeance is not what drives me. My father would not want that. He, and my mother, raised me to believe that it is a privilege to be able to fight for those who cannot. I know there is risk involved, but I feel it is worth it. I am glad you seem to think so too. I'm sorry, Natty. I can't imagine what you've been through. Your father sounds exceptional. He was. Truly extraordinary. And thank you for your kind words. We all have our burdens. My father had a saying about that. Yes, I remember. Rain does not fall on one roof alone. Oh, exactly. Yeah. Soon you and I will put an end to the Ashwinders, beginning with Harlow. And once he is gone, we will turn our attention to Rookwood. We are making progress, 
and we will succeed. Thank yeah. you again for saving me. You deserve all of the praise you have received. Ah. That was a great story about her dad. Jeez. Rebellion. This is so unbelievable. The snow, the holidays. You guys are eating so good. Whoa. What the heck? Let's see. Mm -hmm. Do a little travel. Revelia. Is there gonna be any key for me? There should be a key somewhere around here. I need that key. Feel this. Maybe we can do this. So five plus one, six. So six plus five equals eleven. So so zero, one, two, three, four, five. It would be that crab, maybe. Wait, was this one question mark right here? I have to figure out what that is. Four plus two. Six. So zero would be the owl. The owl. This one. And then there should be another. Where's the other one for that? Do you have another number somewhere? Here's that thing. Doing the high. Let's just wander a bit. Try to find that dang key. up a little higher do we think <gasps> there it is there it is there you are we gotcha gotcha, gotcha. Rebellion. the number thing is up there too i need to go up again let's check this out right there okay Wait, so is this a different puzzle? It is a different puzzle. What the? 15 plus two. So six would be, what is six? Zero, one, two, three, four, five. Is that the lizard? Check it. Lizard. And then we got snake. Zero, one, two, three, plus four, five, six, seven. Maybe the little octopus looking thing. This? Is this it? Yes! We got it! Competitive school robe. Ravenia. Great. Oh yeah, collection updated. Short stairs. Okay, so, whoa, almost fell. Let's go down here. I don't know where that other number thing is for the other puzzle. Say what? I gotta go down again. Which Okay. This thing. We need another number. Here we go. Nice. Just one more after this. Let's go. Okay. Pavelia. Where could that other number? It over here? Yes. Let's see. Dun, 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 dun. Open! Amazing! Ornate juniper gloves. Rebellion! Wow, small Bavarian decorations. 
Oh, there's stuff in here. Oh, I can unlock this. Hello, Homura. Nice. Awesome. Finally, I have not explored in here. Lumos. I don't think I have. <gasps> Revelia. What? Whoa, huge troll. Another puzzle? That would be one zero one two three four five six seven eight. So that's eight plus. One, nine, so that would be zero for the double question mark. Singular question mark, so eight plus 12, so 20, so two. Zero, one, two, so it would be goat head? <laughs> like that, and then double question mark for the other. Revelia. Right here. Let's see. Yes! Another door! Oh my god, we're getting these. What? Finita. What just happened? Revelia. What? Gorgon portrait. An oil painting of a beautiful Gorgon and her suitor, whose eyes are wisely averted as he bends to kiss her hand. It is said that the artist who painted this accidentally gazed at his subject when he delivered the painting and is now forever a sculpture in a garden in Greece. Whoa! That's crazy. Oh my goodness. An identified back item. Revenia! Oh, I love all the statues. Wow. That's so crazy. That one, like, ooh, spooky looking. Hey, so cool. Ah, oh, the night. Oopsie. Oh, and a painting. Revelia. Lumos. Oh, over over here, there's a moth. I see it now. I see a moth. That was easy. Nice. Bring you over here. Awesome. Another field gathering. Did I hear something over here though? Hmm, might have been this. A little more. This. Guys, oh my god, we gotta wait till Take night. A wait until night. Another mine now, demi guys. Good. I think we need like maybe one more after this, and then we can get level three. Rebellion. Oh. There is a depulso room there, but we'll, we'll come back at some later time for that. Rebellion carrying on. What is this? Yes! Is this the last token? This is what I'm talking about. Go! Go! Nice! Last one! Amazing. We got them all. That is something else up here. Revelia. Wow. Oh my, we're in potions class. Let's do, let's do a maxima, why not? Oh, beautiful, wow. Okay, we'll go back to where our house chest is, maybe? Oh. Dang it. 
let's see, 11 plus goat head, so 2, so 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. The spider. The spider, the spider. The spider. And where is the spider? Rebellion! Second? up here oh it is it is the second one is what is that so eight seven six five plus nine nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen so three three-headed snake or dragon three-headed thing it. That's it. Let's get whatever this is. Ah! Awesome. Horse or sir hat. I hear Rosania. someone talking. Whoa. What are you up to now? Yes, right here. Return them all. Here Amazing. we go. The last house token. Time to see what's what inside. Is it gonna be inside. <gasps> That's so cool. Oh my god. What the? <gasps> Whoa, what is it? Just wow, this look at that. Oh, Slytherin Thanks Relic goes House to the former uniform. headmistress, Eupraxia Mole. <laughs> Amazing. What's that? Identify some gear. Whoa, got a lot of stuff. Oh my god. Let's check it out. What did we get? Oh, this is better. Nice. Increased damage dealt to cursed targets. This is better. Oh, I kind of like the way that looks. Keep that, maybe. Is there anything better? Ooh, that's kind of cool. Whoa. Ooh, I like that. Very nice with the dragon. Very cool. Competitive school road. Twilight cloak. Nice. Change appearance. So many different types of school cloaks. Distinguished. Oh, that looks pretty good. Flamboyant cloak. Whoa, the purple. It'd be all purple. Slytherin relic. Whoa, that looks nice. Cool, all right. Well, that's what I had to do in here. Let's see what's next. Hmm. Speak with Nelly. Now that we got the ch house chest open, I should share what I've learned with Nelly. Let's do that. Okay, where's Nelly? Rosalia, the ghost. There's one of those fire things over here. Let's get that. Confringa. Ah, amazing! Another field guide page. I can't believe Rosalia. it. Something else dang. What was it? What was it that day? Oh, what? It's flying around. Amazing. Oh my god. Revenia. Whoa.
go this way. Mm -hmm. Oh, I think I already went over there, yep. Oh, and there's stuff in here. Level one! Hello, Amora. Awesome. Ah. Uh. Right there. There we go. <laughs> nice. I found all of the keys and opened my house chest. Oh, wonderful. What did you find? I found a rather interesting costume. Brilliant. Whew. Well, thank you for solving that mystery for me. I always wondered what those keys would lead to. Yay. Awesome. And then we have Jerry Crawl. I don't know where that would be. So let's speak to the portrait of Professor Nim Fitzgerald in the map chamber. Oh, oh my goodness. Hello. So cool. Welcome back. That's so cool. Hello. Oh my god, he's looking at me. <sighs> Hello, Professor. I have news. The goblins are looking for something. Another repository. They've built drills to help with their search. Oh, most troubling. Are these repositories like the broken container I found at Rookwood Castle? They are. I fear we have no time to lose. Have a look at the map. Fortunately, the next trial is fairly nearby. It's Hogwarts. As you know, I was headmistress in my time. My portrait hangs in the headmaster's office. In fact, I witnessed Professor Black learn of your arrival. And I'll confess that I wondered about you. Wait, is the next trial in the headmaster's office? It is. I had hoped that when the time came, the occupant of that office would be of help to us. Unfortunately, this headmaster seems wildly unconcerned with anything but himself. You'll need to access the office while he's away. I understand. Very well. We'll find some way to get in. Good. I shall meet you in my portrait there. Until then. Whoa. How will I gain access to the headmaster's office? Perhaps Professor Fig will know what to do. Professor Fig! My goodness. Jeez, let's look at our map first. Travel. Good. Revelia. I'm sure they likely hadn't heard the house at all. I feel like I look as good in here. Let's just see. Hello. I never went up here. Oh my gosh. Hello, Hamora. Checking it out. Oh my goodness. He has another staircase. Rebellion. What the? Big chest. And there's a letter. Possible classroom games. Levitation lesson. Encourage students to levitate blocks through raised hoops or similar. Disarm and dodge. Hone Expelliarmus and Reflexus. Targets on a tangent. Back to basics with casting practice on targets enchanted to move quickly. Oh, another chest right here. Unidentified head item. Let's check it out. Whoa. 
right up here. What? Pavelio. And a secret room right here? A little more. What? Oh, this is one of those different locks. Nice. What? Whimsical sorcerer hat? Here, 49 coins. Rebellion. Whoa. Dark Tower Cell. It is said that centuries ago, a charms professor kept a troll here on which students could practice particularly challenging spells. Shocking to be sure, but perhaps unsurprising during a time when Quidditch involved the use of live snidgets. One can only wonder what it may be used for in the future. Wow. So cool. Shell honey brown for the wand. Beautiful! Love checking it out. Whoa. Pictures there. My goodness. Pavelio. Great. Awesome classroom. I knew I had to check it out though, because I went in there at the beginning of the game and I had no idea how much there was gonna be in every every inch of this game. Covered with magicalness. Oh yes! Revelia! I haven't been down here in a while. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. Did I get to do this one yet? Confringo! Oh my goodness! Yes. Chest. Oh my goodness, I love so much behind over here. And I know Professor Fig has a demi guys in his classroom, so that'll be great. That might be our last one we need to get. Unlock three. Woo, house emblem scarf. Professor Fig. Wait. Hello. Professor Fig, I might need... What was do we have here? It was Demi nighttime ties. before and I changed it. Dang, Flabbit. Let's try again. Change it tonight. Mine now, Demi guys. Professor Fig, we're gonna have to wait again for him. Yes! Rebellion! Okay, now we wait again. Okay, hello! I hope I- Professor Fig, the Keepers have shown me where the next trial is. Has something changed? Bloodgog and I have learned that the goblins are searching for another repository, like the one we saw at Rookwood Castle. And I discovered that they're building massive drills to help in their search. Professor Fitzgerald seemed very concerned. I see. Ranrock clearly knows even more than we suspected. And, sir, there's something else. Lodgok knew Miriam. He knew Miriam? They encountered each other at Rookwood Castle. They were friends. She was doing research. That's where she found the container with the port key. He liked her so much that he let her leave with it, despite orders from Ranrock. I don't know what to say. She could win over almost anyone. I want to hear more of this. And, in fact, I'd like to speak with Lodgok directly. But we've no time now. Where is the next trial? It's Believe here. it or not, it's in the headmaster's office. Incredible. All right. You'll need the password to get past the stone gargoyle. The headmaster's house elf will know it. I've actually met Scrope, but I'm not sure he'll tell me. He's rather devoted to the Black family. He is. So you'll need a disguise. Oh my God. I have just the thing. A Polyjuice Potion. You'll look and sound oh like God. Professor Black. Wait, doesn't Polyjuice Potion require a bit of the person you want to change into? And take ages to brew? It does. So oh how do you already have Polyjuice Potion to change into Professor Black? One never knows when such a thing may come in handy. Let's just say I felt the need to be prepared for nice. anything after my fruitless trip to the Ministry on his behalf. 
Now, time is of the essence. Drink up and I shall explain oh more. Oh my god. <gasps> Whoa. What? Oh, that cloak. Oh. oh boy. Oh my god. How do you feel? <clears throat> Incredible. I won't forget that taste anytime soon. <clears throat> How do I sound? Convincing. I've taken the liberty of transfiguring your robes. As we discussed, you'll need the password from Scrope, who could be anywhere in the castle. You might look for Professor Kagawa. She's taken to badgering the poor elf about Quidditch in the hopes that he can convince Black to change his mind. Thus far, unsuccessfully. I see. But what if Professor Black sees me? Leave him to me. I shall tell him where to meet a liaison from the Ministry in Hogsmeade. That should give you plenty of time. Thank you, Professor. I suppose we'll meet again in the map chamber. It's rather strange to hear gratitude coming from Professor Black. <laughs> I'll see you there. Now to find this the Headmaster's crazy. house elf. Whoa. It's so weird playing as him now. That's so cool. I love it. Oh my goodness. Wow. Do you have a moment, oh. Professor? Professor, I was hoping to catch you. I... Oh, I, um, places to be, Professor Sharp. Places to be. Of course, sir. Only... Oh, my God. <clears throat> you'd asked me about a particular potion, and I... Well, I... I did? I did, yes. Well, spit it out, Sharp. I don't have all day. Probably best not to discuss it here, sir. Really? Why can't we talk about potions here? Seems fine to me. Very well. I've brewed the cure for boils you <sighs> wanted. I can drop it by your office when it's convenient. <laughs> of course, yes. No need for all the cloak and dagger. <laughs> Simply have a student deliver it. A student. Very well, sir, if you insist. I do. And thank you, Sharp. I just hope you've brewed enough for all oh my, my boils. <laughs> Announce it to everyone, I love it. Now, to determine which student gets this rather unenviable task. <sighs> Stand God. proud, purebloods. <clears throat> the future is yours. Oh my God. I haven't time for any of you at the moment. None. None. I thought I heard the headmaster approaching. Gareth. I wonder if I sh should have talked to him, but I don't want to give away my cover. Chewing with your mouth open? Where are your manners? Headmaster, here. Yeah. What could he want? You talked to him? Mr. Gaunt, where do you think you're going? I beg your pardon, sir. I'm simply on my way outside. Taking the day off, eh? Typical student, wasting the hours away. I... I have to write 20 inches on Dittany, and its uses was heading to the greenhouse. Ah, yes. Mixed with, uh, bubo tuba pus <laughs> makes a, a fine, uh, mustache paste. Yes, mustache paste. Uh, I find. <clears throat> Are you feeling all right, sir? You don't seem yourself. I assure you I am quite healthy, Gaunt. If I need a medical diagnosis, I shall head to St. Mungo's. Oh, my God. I wonder what Gareth would have said. Something. Has anyone seen my ivory-handled hand mirror? Of course you haven't. Professor, a word? Professor Black, again, it is not too late to reconsider your decision regarding Quidditch. We... we could still have trials and a somewhat shortened season. It would be better than none at all. But the injury, Madam Kogawa. Professor, more than one student has taken a bludger to the head on our pitch. I dare say it knocked some sense into them. And they are fine now. The fact that it happened to be a pure blood, well, that's no reason to... What nonsense! That you would trivialize the health of a student over a, a silly game. A silly game? I... You are 
quite <sighs> impossible sometimes. Sir, I have a good mind to write to the Department of Magical Games and Sports at the Ministry about you. Good idea. I can even provide the parchment should you need it. Now, where is my elf? I... parchment? Very well, I will, and with pleasure. And I spotted Scrope in the Great Hall. Seems to be avoiding me. Hmm, I wonder why. Good day, Madam Kagawa. <laughs> yep, write to them. Let them know that he's to taken it away. When I witness what passes for magic in these halls, I... Uh, I... Simply mourn for the future of the wizarding world. Where is Scrum? Oh my god, look at that person. They're walking on the wall. Oh no, it's the headmaster and he's coming this way. Miss Broom, a word. Oh, Professor, this is an uh, interesting surprise. It's Bloom, by the way. Remind me of your area of affinity, Broom. OWLs are swift approaching. Charms, sir. Nonverbal spells. Might work on one that makes me disappear. Well, keep at it, Broom. And before no. you know it, you'll be as invisible as that new fifth year seems to be. They're not invisible, sir. I've seen them near the library. In fact, they help me with my, uh, heavy books. <laughs> Speaking of invisible, where's my blasted house elf? Oh my god, I love it. Something seems a little off with the headmaster. Yeah, something's a little off. Ding, ding. Oh, are those lights? Oh my god, that's so pretty. You call that a shine on those boots? Do better! Oh my god. That's a Professor, really I need to speak to you. Hello, Professor Black. Ah, Professor Weasley. How, how delightful to see you. Sir? Ah, uh, since I have you here, I wonder if I might, um, speak with you about Professor Fig. Oh. Oh my god, the name. Oh, well. I've decided to give him a bit more, uh, leeway with his time. Leeway, Professor? Are you sure that's wise? I confess I do worry for his students. He's rarely here as it is. I realize that, and I'd like to keep it that way. I see. But, sir, if I may, I am wary of how much time the new fifth year seems to be spending away from the castle, supposedly on Professor Fig's behalf. I've heard unsettling rumors of their escapades. Everything from sneaking into the Forbidden Forest to confronting Ranrock's loyalists and Rookwood's lot. <coughs> what? <coughs> Goodness, you cannot believe everything you hear, Professor. No, 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 you cannot. Uh, I mean, I shall keep an eye on Fig. You simply keep doing the wonderful job that you're doing. Simply wonderful. I... well, I... Uh, thank you. But I'm happy to look into... Uh, good, good. That'll be all, Weasley. I, I mean, Professor Weasley. Good day. Wow. A wonderful job. Leeway for Professor Fig. I shall never understand that man. Whoa, that am I gonna to give, give a Professor speech? Fig some breathing room? Speech time. Scrope is hard a worker as any house. Oh, it's Scrope! Scrope! Oh, greetings, Master. Remind me of the password to my office. <laughs> oh. But Master made Scrope swear never to tell anyone, even Master himself. And now I'm telling you that you can tell me. Uh, uh yes, sir. Uh, of course, sir. Uh, Scrope begs forgiveness. It is the Black family motto, Master. Hmm. Right. Of course. I, uh... Master does remember it. No. <sighs> It's pure bloods forever, isn't it? Uh, uh, close, Master. Uh, Scrope thinks Master is indeed testing Scrope. Uh, it is always pure. <laughs> Obviously. And, of course, as Master knows, in French. Ah, <sighs> yes, of course. Uh, 
I order you to pronounce it for me. Oh, Master knows that Scrope's French is most pitiful. <laughs> oh, very well. Uh, toujours pure. Uh, there is another matter, Scrope. I confiscated this filthy diary from a student. It smells of squid and seawater. Oh, Apollonia's diary. <clears throat> that is quite a surprise, Master. What do you wish Scrope to do with this treasure? Oh. Uh, uh, rubbish. Whatever you wish, Scrope. It's your nice, treasure. Good. Now, off with you. <laughs> the polyjuice potion's wearing off. I best get out of sight. Uh, oh my god, out of sight? Uh oh. Um. Over here? This is, I guess, kind of out of sight. Ah, <sighs> made it just in time. It's wearing off. <coughs> oh. Fig was right. I can't believe it wow. worked. Now, to speak the password to the gargoyle. Oh, a chest. We got nine plus seven, so we need plus eight to be spider for this one. Spider, spider, and we have owl, so eleven plus three. Three headed snake or dragon. <laughs> yep, that should do it. Woohoo! Oh my god. Nice. Teal Chinese Fireball Scarf. And collection update Wizard Rebellions. What? Something dings so loud, I don't know. Awesome. Oh my god. Screen. Pavelia. This one now, we can do this. Okay. So, spider. Can't see. Spider, which is 8 plus 5. So it'd be like just 0, which would be owl. <laughs> yep. And then 3 plus. Two, so five plus nine, which would be like this root looking thing. Where's the other? Oh, right here. Not that. This thing. Let's see. Yay! I'm always like amazed when we get inside of this. Ravenia! It's too crazy. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Do. Do, 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 do. So cool. Let's go down here. Okay. Whoa. Ah, is this it? Oh, yeah. We were here too before. Whoa. The gargoyle. Oh. That's where I need to speak whoa. the password. Awesome. 
Toujours pure. Toujours pure. <laughs> Whoa. Revelio. Let's go up here. Whoa. That's so cool. So I wonder cool. if all the elite wizarding families have a motto. <sighs> Revelio. I wonder. Whoa, whoa. Field guide page. Sleeping portraits. Not all headmasters and headmistresses enjoy reliving the day-to-day -day challenges of running a school of witchcraft and wizardry. Some prefer to enjoy a well-earned nap when possible. I love it. Are they sneak? Oh, they're sleeping. Look at them all snoozing. Oh, good for you. Take a nap. <laughs> Sometimes Rebellion. you just need a good nap. There's something else, right? No, I think we're good. Whoa, what a nice office. What? The hat, the sorting hat. What? Right here. The sorting hat. This enchanted hat was created by the four founders of Hogwarts as the means by which students would be placed into one of the four schoolhouses. Skilled at legitimacy, the sorting hat can see into the wearer's head, allowing it to determine their thoughts and abilities. Legitimacy, what an interesting word. Wow, collection update, the sorting hat. Oh my goodness. Level three. Look at the books up there. Sleeping, more sleeping professors. I love it. Swirl lilac. It's good to oh. see you. All thanks to Professor Fig's quick thinking. Now what? Approach the pedestal in the antechamber and read the book that appears. What can I expect to find in the book? A story. I cannot say more. <sighs> You may recognize some elements of it, as I was inspired by a tale with which many wizarding children are familiar. I suspect there will be more to this than reading a book. Your suspicions are correct. We shall speak when you are finished. Has this been under the headmaster's nose all this time? Apothecary receipt. Cure for boils. One file. <laughs> Take a cup of tea with me. Revenia. This is fascinating. Receipt, hair tonic, mustache wax, bundy mun pomade, comb, pearl handled, back scratcher, gold handled, doxy side, paid in very small part, remainder, rebuild to the ministry. Ooh. Oh my god, the statue of him, a little bust of his head. Whoa. Whoa. Pedestal. That must be the pedestal. Revelio. Mm, Whoa. Oh. <sighs> what? Where what am is I? This? Professor Fitzgerald. No color. Can you hear me? This I am odd. here. In this place, you may call me Leave. You shall be witness to a fable. Pay attention. Things are not always as they seem. We're in the storybook. You must move swiftly and cautiously. Use so the tools you amazing. encounter to find me. This is incredible. The first you will need is a cloak. And go in. Make your way through the town without being seen. This is so cool, you guys. I am stunned. In this place, as in life, death takes many forms. Avoid each of them at all costs.
can't go into any of these? Eh? Oh, they're right there. What are they doing right there? How do I not be seen? Look at them. Oh. <gasps> Who are you? Who are you? Who are you? I should have run when I could. I guess these are okay. Now. <sighs> these people are fine. Is that a cloak? What is this? Wickenwald potion. In case I need it, I guess. Okay. Uh. Hi, yay, yay. What's going on? What's going on? Oh my goodness. I'd best move while I can. Neve must be here somewhere. Neve. Oh boy. Can I hop over the side? Can't go over there? Cannot ho hop over the side. Alright. Alright. I need to time this just right. A staircase straight ahead. Staircase? Huh. Anything over here? What the? In the water? A ladder. Perhaps they won't be able to find me if I go up there. Okay. Maybe they won't. Uh oh. Uh oh. What is this? Oh, it's those demons. Ghosts of death. Up the ladder. Okay. Good. I can see them. Death's dark mongrel is out there too? Looks like he's got some bad breath. He's blowing bad breath at them. That's pretty nice. I don't think I can go over there. Maybe up? Oh. Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Down. I can't stand this much Whoa. longer! I need to get out of here! Well, follow me. Another Wiganwald potion, man. Good to be prepared, I guess. Hopefully we this won't This is my chance. It. I'm coming, Neve. Dude, are you hiding too? Cross this road as fast as I can. Okay. We did it. We did it. We did it. That's where I need to go. But I need to find a way past them. Oh my, 
Nervous Nelly. What is that? What is Nothing that? Nothing this way, but more danger. Oh. There must be another way to find you. I need to turn back. There's no getting past them that way. like the only safe way forward. Yes. Oh good, it's shut behind me. Good, good, good. What is happening? Okay. Are they right there too? guys mm -mm. now's my chance girl stand up run okay all right got away from them over there very good very nice hearing more of them though that's the way forward. It is? Mysterious cloak, is it? Love the music. Ooh, the, ooh, the music. Mysterious cloak. Whoa. Can this be? Visibility cloak. I think I'm invisible. supposed to walk by them okay they can't That's see great. me at all I can get closer to them is this light yikes oh my god what That's so crazy this is the way forward. Finally free. Now, where are you, Neve? Whoa. Coming out of the storybook? Oh, we're in this land again. Whoa. You have outrun death thus far, but have yet to find me. Keep searching, but this time you will be unable to hide. Wield the wand you see before you. Do not squander its extraordinary power. Whoa. Oh my goodness. I've never felt such power. Did that do something different in my wand? It, oh, I have some. Okay, I'm using like not my wand. I don't. Revenia. Her wand? I don't know. Bombarda. Bombarda. Revenia. And Revenia. So now I can fight death. Don't have invisibility. Oh, go. What the? Wow. Rebellion. We can weld. Okay. Ah. Whoa. Yikes. Another Wigan weld. That's good. Some 
fighting. Says flies. Whoa. What's going on over here? Oh. Yep. Defender! Bombarda! Let's go. We're gonna need a lot of these. We got an iffy feeling. Defender! Woo! Bombarda! 
coming up good. Save a health potion. Avelio. Okay, cleared this out pretty good. Pretty good. On to the next. That was tough. Not gonna lie. What is this? What is this? Walking very slow. Okay, okay. Going into the white again. Beautiful singing. Simple stone. This must be for me. Simple stone. Let's get it. Mysterious stone. Finished. Pass through the mourners ahead. Nothing is what it seems. The mourners. I still have a wand, but I don't know if I can use it. The mourners. <laughs> She's gone. Neve's dead. Oh, Neve. Oh, poor Neve. Gone so young. Let us always honor her memory. May her memory be a treasure to us forever. Oh, death. Whiteness again. Oh, what was that mean? You found me, but you cannot undo oh what has been done. The magic of the stone can only conjure a shadow of my former self. What? What? This is crazy. This is so wild. Neve. Whoa. The teardrop statue. But Whoa. there is no light without shadow, as there is no shadow without light. Simply because you can eliminate darkness does not always mean that you should. Wow. Beautifully said. Oh my god. Remember that as you witness my memory. Okay. I'll check it out. Isadora, what you did for your father was remarkable. Well, wasn't it? And Percival needn't worry about the strands of emotion or the traces that this magic leaves. I found a way to contain all of it. You haven't stopped. Oh, goblin wow. Silver. You spoke to a goblin about this. Don't worry, he has no idea what we're containing. We don't know what effect any oh of this God. may have. The emotions, the dark traits. You sound like Percival. And as it happens, I do know. It is a source of strength, of focus. Somehow it enhances my ability to wield magic. I don't follow, Isadora. I think we can harness it. Power like this is not to be toyed with in the wrong hands. You saw again. what I did for my father. Oh, imagine the good we could do. Everyone is in some kind of pain. This must stop. 
All of us. You've kept this power to yourselves for so long because you fear it. I choose to embrace it. Whoa. Jeez. You can't take people's pain without asking first, come on. Whoa. My god, where are we? What is this? Oh, I got the egg. What is this? The map chamber. Nice. Oh. Is there a newly arrived keeper? What? Is it true? Oh. Has someone completed the first three trials? It is, and I have. But you are so... Young. I know. <laughs> you must be Professor Bakar. I am. Pleased to meet you. The pensive memory I just witnessed. Was Isadora inhaling painful emotions? She was. That's crazy. I found it disturbing. But how did she gain power from it? How did she harness it? It was disturbing, although I wonder that you are asking about her power. I hesitate to reveal the location of my pensive to someone who, perhaps, has yet to understand the responsibility of power. I can assure you, Professor, I do. In fact, what you don't yet know is that a dangerous goblin called Ranrock has accessed the repository at Rookwood Castle. He has learned to harness the contents of it as a source of immense power. He plans to use that power against wizard kind. We have no time to waste. I see. Nonetheless, the knowledge you shall gain after you witness my memories is too valuable to share without further consideration. I shall require time to confer with the other keepers. Wow. It seems we have no choice but to wait, frustrating as it is. I heard what you told Professor Bakar. Isadora was inhaling emotions to gain power? She was, and she pulled emotions as she did from her father, from Professor Fitzgerald, without permission. Monstrous. What's more, she said that she found a way to store the traces of magic she extracted in Goblin Silver. The repositories? Possibly. There's something I didn't get a chance to tell you earlier. Ranrock has been digging at locations tied to the five names he found in the journals of a goblin metal worker named Bragbore. Five names? The Keepers, and who else? Isadora Morganak? Precisely. That's how he's been one step ahead of us. Gringotts, the Tower, Rookwood Castle. If wow. the Keepers won't tell you where the next trial is yet, I say we at least maintain a watch on Ranrock. Perhaps he'll lead us to more information. Perhaps. I hope to hear from Lodgok soon. I haven't heard anything since I learned of the drills. Oh, and as you've probably guessed by now, your Polyjuice plan worked like a charm. Yes. I knew it would. I may have done too good a job distracting Black. I had no idea he can't hold his fire whiskey. <laughs> Whoa! Oh my god. It's crazy. Now we got all of them there. Oh my god. Jeez. I don't even know what would... I shouldn't have Sebastian. reacted so bitterly about your goblin right. friend. I apologize. I hope we can finish what we started with the triptych. Please meet me at the southern coast. We can search for the final canvas piece. I don't know, Sebastian. I don't know. That's a Weasley. I don't hear anything. There was a note. Well, let's check our quest. I'm sure Professor Weasley wanted to do something. Okay. Oh, wow. So, Sebastian, prepare for your search for the final keeper. Jeez. Speak with Deke. Phoenix Rising. Let's talk with Deke. 
Secret rooms. Let's go. That trial was so insane with... Oh my god. I hope you guys enjoyed that last trial. I was amazed with like the comic book look of it. Let's do... Is there anything we have to identify? Yeah, I guess so. Dun, 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 dun. Deke? Hello, Deke. Professor Weasley said you had an idea. Indeed, Deke does. Uh, Deke knows that you want to learn about all sorts of beasts. And Deke recently heard rumors of a phoenix nest in Whoa. a nearby mountain. A phoenix nest? I wonder if it belongs to the phoenix Natty mentioned, the one Harlow and the poacher pack are after. Deke would not doubt it. If Deke has heard of it, surely the nasty poachers have as well, which means it could be in danger. Well, I'd better go and rescue it then, hadn't I? Deke thinks so. So majestic a beast should not fall into such vile hands. Deke is not sure why, but Deke feels that saving a phoenix might help to make amends for what happened with Deke's prior master. Deke hopes that you are able to find the phoenix and bring it to the room where it will be safe. Yes. Do a wiggin weld. We'll do Duris. Nice. And we'll do invisibility. That's great. Yeah. Alright. So we're gonna leave here. We're gonna go to two quests. Search the cave. Whoa, that's over here, okay. So I think maybe this one. Butterflies over here. These rocks have seen better days. Butterflies! Let's follow them. Where are you going, butterflies? Could it be a Merlin trial? Could it be? Butterflies, let's go. Next time I see Fig or that student, I'll give them what they deserve. Woo! Where are we going, butterflies? Right here? Pavelio. Oh, nice. Collection updated bushes. Wow. What is this Merlin trial? Oh. Uh... Confringo! Pavelio! Where's the other ones? Any who oppose Ramrock. Confringo! What was that? An intruder! An intruder! Confringo! Beautiful. Awesome. Now we can do this one. So it's like... Revelia. Mm -hmm. Confringo! Is that 
gonna do it? So tricky Dragons. after all, Merlin. Heck yeah. Revelio. All right. Something over here. This looks like trouble. <laughs> what is this? Yeah, done. Ancient magic, focus three. Okay, we're invisible. Most stores in Hogsmeade know me by sight. Revelio. to attend by Expelliarmus! Don't give me that look. You find yourself, you do, before I take it into my head to do something that will give you a real look. Of pain. Of pain. Let's get this one. Ah, Mr. Tellus! Nice. for you.
Nice. Ooh. Wow. So cool. I don't know where those flu flames are. Even in a fight. on the map isn't far from here. The hippogriff marks the spot. Revelio. Whoa. There's, like... <gasps> where are the flu flames? Oh, Perhaps right here. not the best place to be caught alone. True. <gasps> right, what's over here? Is the phoenix gonna be over here? this cave whoa blockade Brookwood's poachers are already here I should have sold some stuff my gear is gonna be like overload 
Revelio. is that? Oh. Confringo! Nice. Chest, frog, choir stand. Awesome. Okay. A little treasure. That's awesome. Through the other way. Can't go up. Can't go up. So we go this way. Peekaboo, it's a chest. Someone having a pet troll and not much else. They come after me. I'll stick them like a knocktail. Flung off somewhere. Confringo. Arrest them. Confringo. Nice. Your poaching days are over. They're over. Revelio. Revelio. Oh yeah, that was on that side. Oh, there's gonna be spiders. <laughs> Lovely. Oh, Revelio. Confringo. This out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Expelliarmus! Incendio! Rebellion! Ha! Get that nice ha. elegant casual uniform. Rock and roll. Confringo. Huh. Fifty-three coins. Hey, been here. Let's go this way. Whoa, long way down. Oh my god. Said that. We keep him More poachers. How many are there? Hmm. You think you can release our dragon and get away with it? Yes. Yes, I do. <laughs> Someone messing about. Yes, I am. Got you all just like that. Wow. Again. 
I go through here? Ah! Whoa! <gasps> the Phoenix. Phoenix! Let me save you! So pretty! So magical! Oh it my almost God. seems as if it wants me to follow it. I need to find it before the poachers do. What? Velio. Oh, level three. Okay. What the? This is insane. Hello. Can I go over here? Oh my god, that looks so wild. With the cart. Whoa. There it is again. Hello, hello. Oh, Revelio. Oh my goodness. Okay, jump. Reaches. <laughs> Reach to the peak of the mountain. So there should be some spiders around here, I guess. Confringa. Whoa. That was it? Or clump juice? Revelia! I'll take it. <laughs> Go up here. <gasps> ah, spider. Simply too many. Too many. Pavelia. Confringo. Pavelia. Arrest in the night. Please. Amazing. What is that? Spider fan. Jump over here. And up. Whoa. The Thunder Brew is so intense. Okay. Confringo! Stuff over here. Treasure. Hmm. Square shaped paintings. Collection update. Pavelio. 
Whoa. Get this. And this. And then boom. Confringo. Break it. Nice. Where is this Phoenix? Pleased. Deke's gonna be thrilled. So happy. Rebellion. I love it. Oh, that just made me so happy. I'm so glad. We saved the Phoenix. Should investigate. <sighs> awesome. Well, let's return this to Deke. Oh, wait. Where are we? Oh, a humongous, a humongous spider. That's how we're doing it. Incendio. Oh my. Oh my. Okay. Confringo. Okay. Thunder Brew. We're doing it. Let's go see Deke. Deke. Did you find the phoenix? Yes, Deke. And I rescued it from the poachers. I have it here. It's safe. Remarkable. Well, what are you waiting for? Deke cannot wait to... What a beauty. You keep it close. Oh. So sweet. Professor Weasley and Deke were right to tell you about the Room of Requirement. Look at all you've done, and how many beasts you've rescued. A phoenix is safe now, because of you. I couldn't have done it without your help, Deke. Thank you. Uh, Deke is grateful for the kind words, and 
also grateful to have been of assistance to someone like yourself. Helping you do such good for so many beasts has given Deke a sense of peace Aww. Deke hasn't known in years. Deke will always be here for you when you need him. So sweet. Oh my god. All right, you guys, I'm going to leave off today's episode here before we check out the Phoenix. Every time I've tried walking up those steps, my computer has just crashed, so we're going to roll with it. But I hope you guys enjoyed this jam-packed full of goodness episode. It was so much. It was awesome. And I will catch you guys real soon, so stay tuned. I love you guys so much. Peace out. Bye, guys.